Gulf cities across Russia and Kazakhstan on Wednesday after Europe's third longest river burst its banks, swamping parts of the Russian city of Orenburg and forcing over 100,000 people to evacuate. That included Valentin and Evgenia Perednia, forced to steer a motorboat through the streets. They sent their children to a parent's house out of town, but stayed behind to protect their home from looters. We have no police, no security guards, no one we're guarding our homes and neighboring plots by our own efforts. Where can you go? Nowhere. Rapidly melting snow has swelled major rivers, including the Ural, which runs through Orenburg towards the Caspian Sea. Climate science professor at Reading University, Maria Shargendanova, said the unusual floods may be explained not only by heavy snow this last winter, but also the speed of the melt, possibly due to climate change. Uh, snow melting very rapidly because temperatures uh, were uh, rising very rapidly and within uh, basically days temperatures went from zero and uh, to uh, 17, 18, 20 degrees and that's what caused a very, very rapid uh, snow melt. Russian officials said it is the worst flooding in Orenburg since breakfast began. Russian news agencies quoted the emergencies ministry as saying 38 tons of aid, food, drugs and other necessities have been flown into the region. Kazakhstan has said nearly 100,000 people have been evacuated from flooding within its borders. Russia said over 10,000 houses were flooded across 37 regions, most in the Orenburg Oblast. Upstream on the Ural, which flows into Kazakhstan, floodwaters burst in Embankment Dam in the city of Orsk last Friday.